Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, I'm gonna teach you how to control AI videos with Magic Brush, Pixverse tutorial. And right now, I'm currently inside the Pixverse landing page or the Pixverse website. Now I have a video about this, it's a full general coverage, so please check it out. Anyway, with this one, you want to log in with your Gmail account, even a dummy one would work out. Also, before you get started, you're gonna need a few images to work with. And I have myself right here, a few images to work with that I got from Mid Journey. So I have one right here. Second one would be this waterfall. Sorry about that one earlier, this is the case. Third one right here would be this girl right here. So let's get started. You wanna go to image to video. And then first, of course, upload your image. As you can see right here, I already have a few images worked out from last time. So once you're here in image to video, I want you to click, of course, upload an image first. So I have a sample image I got from Mid Journey that we're gonna utilize for this video. It's gonna be an airplane with birds. As you can see right there, it's already here. But for now, I wanna create a new one and teach you how to do this one from scratch. So click on Magic Brush, and once you're here, you'll notice on the right side, there are a lot of brushes. Before it's only one to five, but right now we have one to six. Now what it works is, you can color your item, for example, this airplane, you can highlight it and then basically make this move. Or, in a much more faster way, AI detects the airplane as it is on the lower part. Moving over for brush 2, go for birds, and brush 3, go for sky. Awesome, right? Now in magic brush direction, go back on brush 1 to apply movement on the plane. For the brush 2, Apply movement for the birds. And of course, brush 3 will be the sky. This is going to be apply movement. But now, just a disclaimer, guys, it's not always giving an exact um movement that we like, especially this is just a free trial. Upon my trial right here, the hardest part to move is going to be the sky, but let's still try it. I'm going to click on confirm. And now, let's see the quality before we move into it. Help the prompt or help the AI identify your prompt by simply typing what's happening there. So that will be an airplane flying, something like that. Now for the camera motion, I'm gonna leave it as it is. For the motion strength also, I'm gonna leave it as it is. But what it does is, motion strength is the how much your image move. For the HD quality, make sure this is enabled to get the most precise and much more um, clear videos. Click on create right now, and I'll see you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. Right now, as you can see, I have it downloaded to my PC to better have a good quality. Now, this is going to be our video that we did from earlier. And as you can see right there, the airplane is moving exactly. The bird is moving also. Take note, those are more than one birds that we made move. Awesome, right? That is the power of Pixburst Magic Brush. By the way, guys, if I remove this one right there, and then go to the video itself, I just pause that one. You can upscale the video itself to increase more quality. Of course, once you're back on Pixverse and then for the video itself, you can upscale the video to get more quality. And these are the settings from the video itself. So if you click on upscale right there, it will now upscale the request and now it's going to be generated. So while waiting for that one, let's create another example. Now I have so much example here to work with, but now I'm going to go with a waterfall. I think I have a waterfall waiting around here somewhere. Give me a second. Perfect. So I have a waterfall in nature with birds, as you can see. And let's go with magic brush. So it will now auto detect some things inside this photo. So we have bird, number one. We have rock and sky. The three is right here and the water. Now let's have some fun here. First of all, let's go for the birds for the green one. Now for the magic bird direction, I'm just going to do this little arrow right there. For brush 2, I think I'm going to go with water. For the water, I'm just going to make sure there's going to be a ripple effect. Somewhat like there. And then for the 3 over here, let me just remove that one. Go back on number 3. Now, I think this is going to be minimal movement, but still, let's try it out. Moving it right here. For brush number 4, I think I'm going to go with this one with the rock. For the rock, I think we don't need to move the rock here, but for the sake of the discussion, let's just try to move it, even though rocks don't move, right? I'm gonna move it right here. 
And lastly, for the sky, I'm not going to move this one around here somewhere. Perfectly right here. Good. Now I'm just now going to confirm and help my AI to understand my prompts. So I'm going to type in this one, a waterfall. Something like that. By the way, guys, if I go back on my image, on the magic brush, and then the color of the water is orange, right? I'm just going to increase the brush size a little bit and color the water down here. So don't forget the water down here because this is also a good part of the photo. Let's not waste the color of the photo, right? Perfect. And now that being said, let me just redo this one. Perfectly right here. Right there. Perfect. So I'm going to click on confirm now. And I'm going to create this one. So I'll see you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. Right now, before we go to the waterfall, this is going to be the upscale version of our video. As you can see right there, it has upscale. And this is the comparison of the two. This is going to be the HD quality. And this is the upscale quality. Awesome, right? And that is entirely for free inside Pixverse. Alright, so welcome back to the video. Now, this is going to be our photo. We have a waterfall, the birds, and the sky. And if I click on play right there, we have movement. The waterfall is rushing, the sky is moving, and the birds are chirping or flying. Awesome, right? And I really appreciate this video because Pixiverse is a free AI tool and it's really good with this one. Now, for the sake of the discussion, let's try one last example. Since we're not using a human or a girl or a gray wave there, let's try applying this photo with a human. So I have my photo right here. So I have brush one up to six again, and AI is auto detecting what is happening on the video or rather photo. So we have person right there. We have airplane or the spaceships. The buildings are right here. The sky is right there and the sand is right here. So first for the person, I'm going to draw this one a little bit to the right. And I want to highlight how powerful this auto detect option is because I don't really have to highlight everything. It really does the work for me. And then going back on brush three, I think building is what they call it. I'm going to move this one a little bit to the right also. So everything is moving to the right. Perfectly right there. Color this one around on the right also. Perfectly. And of course, for the sand, I'm going to go for brush five. I'm going to go to the right side also. And click on confirm. By the way, guys, before I finish and generating this one, I want to highlight that you don't have to use all the brushes. If you only want to use a brush one or two, that's perfectly fine. It will still work. Doesn't mean that I'm using everything, that you should also use everything from your end. I'm going to type in here a woman in a desert with spaceships hovering above her. Something like that. Perfect. And now I'm going to retain everything with HD quality and I'm going to click on create. I'll see you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. Right now, this is going to be our final video sample. So again, guys, this is the image. And if I click on play right there, look at the movement. The spaceship, the girl is moving, especially the hands right there are moving. Now, before I end this video, I want to show you some other examples that I made. So this is going to be a spaceship that's hovering just solely by the spaceship because I did not use any other brush here to utilize. So it's really good looking, right? By the way, guys, I also have some waterfall here. There is the movement. The water is moving right there. Pretty awesome. So these are just other videos that I get from my, before my um, video in Pixverse. So please check it out. A woman in a motorbike. And anyway, basically that's it. That is how you use the magic brush feature in Pixverse. This is fairly new and please check it out. By the way guys, before we end this video, let's talk about the pricing. Right now I have basic for $0 basically. I have 100 credits renew daily for 50 credits. With that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.